Okay, so this is the demo app which comes with the templates and it's already set up with some demo data here that you can use to uh, check back to the template, see how it's set up. Uh, I've used long sys IDs and link IDs or you can use GUID strings <coughs> if you want to. And we can see here that the order is parent, which is the company, and within the parent there are an unlimited number of contacts, people, and each person has their own uh, particular phone, can have a string of phone numbers down here. And this is linked here to number six, and you can see here the link idea, the idea is up to sys ID here. So this one is set up for auto, uh, the instant copy or auto copy, where we've got this one highlighted here, I'll show that now. And it's immediately copied that, obviously created new link IDs, etc. The other option is to right click. Um, in this case, I've added copy with edit, which means that we now get to open it. And I can type something in there. And then on this one here, you can see it's, it's been added, that's been added to it. So you could either have this defaulting to copy to edit or use this to the instant copy and just add it as another option to the pop-up menu if people wanted to do it that way. The That was copying within the same file as it says there. So copy to another file, which is a destination file here. We can say, um, let's copy that there. This is another option. You can have a little uh, message box pop up if you want. Uh, when And it's handy in this situation because there's nothing immediately happening to this file. So when we go to the destination file, we can see that it's being copied there and it's given a whole new ID set on, the, on that one. Um, within the template, there's other options such as clearing various fields, setting any fields which need to be uh, that which can't be duplicates and the other method which you can use is a batch copy close that this runs off for just a standard clarion process template uh, in this particular case i've hard co hard coded in the the string that you want to use which is looking for canoga in the city field you can, and we'll see in a minute when I click uh, OK that there's three records match that. You can, and the whole thing obviously copies child and grandchild records as well. And if you want to, it says here, you can use your own tag file or queue. There's an embed point where you just do a lookup and it's all explained in the help file. Um, quite simply, really, just to do a lookup into your file or your, your queue. And if it's OK, carry on or, or if it's not filtered so it's in the validate section of the process so i'm going to click ok here it comes up says i've done it we'll have a look at the record and there you can see there's three three of them have been copied over here i'd already edited them there uh, uh sorry i've already put in an insert um an override there so that each copied one has add to in the um, in the address field for one and triple two in fact so as you can see, everything's brought over. In this case, they were two contacts and they had their details. So that's a quick overview there. Uh, here's the, the details for the website. You can go there, you can down, download a copy, uh, a demo copy, which is already compiled, ready to go with the demo data. So you can have a play with that, see how it works. And don't forget also, I do have a guarantee 60 days so there's uh, no risk you you can um, you can buy it and return it within 60 days if it's, it doesn't do what you thought it was going to do so okay then guys thanks for uh, watching this demo